That shit I went bring the next thing. The last thing I'm going to look at before I leave. Sex for movie roles. Wow. We heard this in the past. A lot of young girls said they went to audition for movie roles. And a lot of the movie directors asked them to open wide their legs so that they will, you know, before giving them these roles. But we thought that that was a thing of the past. But if a movie director or any other person will tell a young girl, or any girl for that matter, sleep with me before I give you a certain favor. That is unfortunate, isn't it? That's very, very unfortunate. For me, I think it's most unfortunate. That's how come I cannot patronize and I've never been able to patronize prostitutes. Because I felt that I was taking advantage of them. Because of the little money I have in my pocket, you have to come and do something that you ordinarily not do with me. You understand? So you come out for my money, you give yourself to me. For me, it's a form of human abuse. You understand? I can't do it. I don't know about you and I'm not going to moralize it on you. It's your decision. I would feel truly, truly bad if I told any young girl, sleep with me before I give you this. In fact, I will do what I can. If it happens, fine. But to say, give me yourself before I give you this. What math am I going to use to say that? Would you even have an erection doing this? I would not have one. I would struggle for erection. I would feel cheap. What kind of a person are you? Again, let's read the story. And who is this? Saying that people have been asking her for sex before giving her roles. That's her. She's quite pretty, isn't she? She's not bad looking. Not my taste. Not my kind of girl. But maybe your kind of girl. A lot of ladies have gone through this. She's not the only person. But who is this girl? I am not getting roles because I don't give producers sex. And her name is... It's Amasewa. She's an actress. Come here, let's read it together. The issue of exchanging sex for movie roles has been lacking in the movie industry for some time. While some believe an open secret, not much evidence has been provided to back those claims. Speaking in a one on one interview with Eko Kumsin on a, a Ghana Weekend TV, budding Ghanaian actress and life coach Amasewa, who was answering a question in line with whether a producer has ever demanded sex before giving her a role. I like that. Oh, yes. Because I don't do that, I don't get a lot of roles to play. I have only acted in six, seven major movies. But because I don't do that, I am not getting more roles. Upon persuasion to mention the names of the alleged producers, the budding actress remained adamant. She explained that even though a lot of the movie producers have made sexual advances at her, she is not obliged to mention names for the fear of being sued or blacklisted. Hmm. Mm. Come here. So you see, you see what it is. Open up. Let me do it, and I give you a role. And if you are a lady and you do that, that's the end of your career. But we can rise above this. You know how we can rise above that? We should defy all these men and move with our career. Women should get actively involved in movie making, like Yvonne Nelson and the rest. So that quality, professional actresses can be employed to come and do that without being asked for sex. We know there are lesbians in the industry who can also ask you to have sex with them. Lesbian sex before they give you rules. But move on. Push on and make sure that you make it happen. This is the black pot. A.K.A. Kukushunomo. It's not only about sex. We know many people who go to look for jobs. 
the big man will ask you to sleep with him before he gives you the job. He will tell you, oh, you are so beautiful. I tell, do you have a boyfriend? Oh, I'm single. Okay, I would like to go out with you. I would like to, you know. And you know that once you say no, that's the end of it. Some young women go into it. They get the job. And then they become slaves to this. We all remember First Atlantic Bank. You remember? You remember First Atlantic Bank? You remember the story of Sairam? You remember that story? They are in court. Now they've been asked to present written documents. They're in court. And you know why they are in court, don't you? You do know. Side chick versus a married man. He promised that he was going to marry her, buy her, blah, 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 blah. Divorce his wife and marry her. And he couldn't do it. She's taking him to court. And Ghana trended this news all through the week. They are back in court. This is the Blackport, a.k.a. Kukushonimo. Blackport, Kukushonimo.